Good morning, guys. How are we doing today? Uh, just don't really have any plans uh, as far as what this video goes. I'm just going to kind of wing it. Um, Alright, let's start with the Lost Chapters. Uh, last night, I fully completed normal on Squall. Completed all the missions. Not that hard. Actually, relatively easy. Um, last night, I did try to do the, the big boss right here. Level 90, I had a whole different team set up. I was using uh, Tiff, Tiffa, Zidane, and Squall because they're the three characters that are boosted. And, of course, I have them basically maxed out uh, as best as I can anyways. But I tried to do this one last night. And, oh, my God, I got destroyed. Um, I'm not sure exactly how to go about doing this one um, or what kind of team comp or... I don't know. Um, hopefully somebody posts something that I could follow and maybe I can then relay on how they did it. Um, I don't know. This one was actually really difficult. The fact it's level 90, like even the, the basic enemies, the goblins, the flans, the bats, they were actually kind of tough. Um, the first behemoth that you verse this guy... Uh, he was actually kind of easy. I uh, didn't have too many problems with him. He hit me like one time. The Gaia Behemoth uh, is what actually... Uh, he rocked my world. Uh, with rocks. Heh, <laughs> fine. No. Uh, there is two of him. And they're level 65. And the fact that they just continuously... Like... They cast Stonega, which sets you back. Uh, or no, Stone Ra, and it delays your turn by one, and Earthshaker grants Brave to self, reduces all targets Brave by 75%. Now, th there is a uh, cool little uh, catch to this one. If, 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 if you have zero Brave when they use Earthshaker, they can't steal anything. Um, it legit steals a percentage, so any percentage of zero is zero. Which I thought was kind of cool. Um, of course, Flare uh, is a big magic attack. It was hitting my Zidane for a, a couple grand. Um, so I'm not too sure on how to go about doing this one. I'm going to have to tinker around, play with some party setups, uh, see what kind of flow goes right. Um, they are weak to fire, so Vivi might be an option. Um, I definitely wouldn't use uh, anyone that has earth-based spells. So Yastala is definitely out of the question. Um, just because you need to be able to do mass damage and since they're earth-based casting earth magic, you're not going to do much. Uh, so I'm not too sure. I'll give that another try later tonight. Um, I'll do some of the easier ones later. Um, since I already had Squall, and since I already uh, basically done all these quests previously, um, I did. I got uh, money, or I should say, I got Gil. Sorry, Gil, uh, for doing the missions that give you Squall and doing the missions that would give you the belt. Um, sad to say, since I had already attained the belt from doing the event that it didn't give me two more belts uh it gave me gill so um if you have been playing previously you're just going to get gill i was kind of hoping that it would give me the belt that way i could try to limit you know limit break it all the way up that is not the case if you have done this before and you received the belt from the previous quest it knows and therefore will give you gill uh, if you didn't make it to get the second belt, or if you haven't done the first belt, they will give you the two belts. Um, War Illusions, uh, it's good for hunting for artifacts. Um, it's the same one that we had before Ramu. Uh, you can go in there, get a bunch of artifacts for different people. Um, which, as you guys know, artifacts give passive abilities.
Um, of course, the Hero of Illus is still going on. And that's really about it. Um, I mean, I didn't mean to click that. Uh, for me, this really isn't uh, a big opener for me. Um, the legit, the biggest thing that was for me, and now I'm already working on or already have, is A, I was able to get um, Setzer's Dart. So I have a five-star weapon for him at least. I've only got one copy, so it's not that big. Um, no limit breaks, whatnot. Um, and of course, to actually level Setzer up. Uh, the three characters, Hope, Vanille, and Setzer. Hope and Vanille, I've already got completely done. Um, a lot of my friends have already got the, uh, what is it, uh, Trigger Blade? Is that what it's called? The Cutting Trigger. Um, a lot of my friends, uh, I really shouldn't say friends, just people who I follow on here who seem to have good characters and whatnot, they've already got six star cutting triggers. I've seen a few people with six star hunting rods. I've seen like one person with a six star dart. And I'm just, like, I don't get it. Why, why spend real money on this game? Like, you can get all that stuff without spending real money. And they had it as soon as release was out. Like, I was there... I started playing the moment it came out, and they had already got six star. Like they waited for it. They built up items. They had to buy gems, cause like I don't buy gems at all, and this is where I'm at. Unless they just don't have anything for any other character, and they purposely only level one character, which if that's the case, I feel sorry for them. But anyways. Moving on, that's really about it. Um, I'm going to be doing the Neils and Setzer's um, normals uh, later tonight. Uh, unfortunately, I did get called in to work early, so I am pulling the double. Um, but that's okay. It just means more money in my pocket. Uh, I'm trying to think what else. Uh, for the... Uh, as I said a moment ago, uh, inside a lion's heart, Squall, Tifa, and Zidane are boosted. Inside the girl, girl from Orba, it will be Vanille, Yuna, and Hope. Which, I'm, I'm kind of glad, because, you know, I get to level up, or no. Hope, Hope is boosted, but he's not double XP, so I'm not, I don't care about that. Um, and for the last one, Yuffie and Laguna. Actually, everybody from that last one, Setzer, Yuffie, and Laguna... I didn't do anything with them three at all during the previous event, and Cesar's the only one double XP, so he's probably the only one I'm going to level at this time. Um, of course, my leveling crew is getting slim. I'm getting to my last pickings. Oh, speaking of leveling, my Ramza is now level 50, um, so I tuck him out. Uh, I, that's why you see my current party setup of Setzer, Waka, and of course Titus. Titus is my carry. He is, in my opinion right now, the most OP uh, character in the game as far as being able to auto. And so uh, that's just why he's there. I, You guys know I've had this view before. I don't care much for Titus. But I respect the numbers and numbers never lie. Um, so... Uh, Waka is getting up there. He is almost level 50s. Uh, since Rams is level 50, I'm not going to be doing the Hero of Evelis quest with him anymore. I'm going to be using Waka just because for the points and to be able to level him up. Each quest you do is almost like 1,300 experience. So like three or four usually get him a level. And of course doing the dailies. So Waka will be level 50 in no time. Uh, I have five days to get six levels. That is easy. Um... Setzer with I, I don't know how they're going to do it because I don't I didn't see is there any okay we got two weeks uh, to complete this um, I don't know if the quests are going to be gone forever or if they're just going to cycle through new ones I, 
obviously there will be more info within the two weeks. Um, but that's going to be it for now. Um, I'll update you guys as soon as I get more information. Um, why is there... Okay, complete the Lost Chapter Lines Heart Part 2 and Hard Mode. So do you get two? Because there's an event quest... And a player quest. I, I just noticed that we're going to go try this real quick. We're going to do the easy one. Um... Should be this one. Yeah, Lion's Heart Part 2. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, of course, the Dane's gonna stay in. I'm gonna go ahead and put Squall in there and put Tiff up. Alright, what's my. Uh, no KOs, 100 turns, 10k or less damage. It's level 50, so I don't think it'll be that bad. I will take auto battle off. Um, I do recommend using Ifrit. They are weak to fire. Uh, and plus, they give he gives a t attack. So, if you're not using Ifrit, uh, use... If you don't have Ifrit level 20, try to use... Uh, I would suggest either Chocobo or Sylph if you got them up to level 10+. plus. Um, see, there's one of my friends, Gilgamesh. He's already got six star Squall, but he doesn't even have 50 50 yet. So, I think we're going to take Psycho Cat or Psycho Pat, whatever your name is. If you guys ever see this, you see your name come across the screen. If I mispronounce it, I'm sorry. I'm sure by now you guys know that I'm really bad with names. All right, well, to start things off, this is going to be uh, kind of easy. At least from the looks of it. Uh, well, crap. He used flap. Fap. Flap. Whatever. I'll, I'll take a small hit chance right there. Boom. There he goes. He go, he's going down. All the trash should be simple enough. Is this it? Oh, okay, so part two, you're going verse Behemoth and Gaia Behemoth at the same time. Um, this is my first time trying this uh, one. I tried 10 just to see how well I could do, and like I said, I got destroyed. So we're going to see how well this works. I'm going to try to keep my uh, special abilities as long as I can and pretty much only use them for uh, farming purposes. Or not farming purposes, but uh, for break purposes. Just until long enough to where I can get these, uh, at least one of them killed. If I can get one killed, it'll be uh, easy peasy. Um, we're going to actually go ahead and attack with you. 
Renault Zikian. And then we'll just break you. Ow. Try and get rid of the easier one first. The behemoth obviously is a lower level. So, trying to get rid of him as fast as possible. How all you want, you're not a dog. Oh wait, yes you are. You're dead. Come on, die. Sweet. I, I will take the hit from him. And I'll take the break. That's not a problem. We are going to solid barrel him. And then let's go ahead and break him. Beat rush. Alright, let's see if we can't uh, do massive amounts of damage right here. Free energy. Squall with Renazikian. Uh, we're going to battle cry her. Stellar circle. Give me just a second, guys. I wanted to go ahead and pull over to finish this. Free energy, beat rush. No, I did the wrong one. God damn it. Yeah, you're going to have to just wait, Chica. Sorry. Uh, we're going to go ahead and pull Titus in here. Alright, he's getting ready to do all. I already know what that move is going to be. It's going to be Earthshaker. So we are going to go ahead and expend every brave point we have. Just that way he cannot come back and use it against us. Go go ahead and use this. I should be able to kill him right here. And bye bye. Um, even for uh, part two, that was a uh, that was a little bit difficult trying to fight both of them at the same time. I got the points. No KOs, hundred turns. So that was completely complete. Now, the whole reason I wanted to do this on camera was to see if I got two points, or two things. So, we are going to go to accept, accept, and accept. So, yeah, it looks like you actually get two. I don't know if that's a glitch or not, because you're getting the same thing twice. But, hey, I'm not going to argue. They want to give me two of them. And that will actually give me six, and... Hmm. I'm trying to think of what's best for the actual full group. So Dane needs one. Waka does need his. 
Zetzer, you're already good. You, you need a lot. So does Laguna. Scroll down. Um... You know what? We are going to go ahead and do Waka. Just for the sake of having it. Okay, apparently that was too much to load.